Hello everyone, it's Amanda from Crafty Fit and today I have a um, Tuesday morning haul. I have not been to Tuesday morning in probably over a year. Um, I want to say it was probably like right before the pandemic hit. Um, I was able to go out to mine and then by the time I got word that ours was closing down, I was only able to go to one of them and the other one I just closed down automatically. So, and I was really upset because that one was really close to us. So the closest one that we have now is probably, it's not too, too far. Um, it's just in a little bit of a hard area to get in and out of. Um, so I, me and my mom were around the area and we, decided to stop in so I could see what they have on clearance and just wanted to see what I could get my hands on because I have been seeing a lot of people hauls and um, I wasn't sure how well ours was doing on the craft section but they did have a big craft section what was which was awesome um, and I was able to get a couple things on clearance so the first two things that I got were these project life cards one is from Heidi Swap one is called Salsa so all the words are in Spanish um, which I didn't really realize it until I got home but that's okay I'm fine with it I love the colors I love how I can maybe use this as um, you know, like a back of a photo or something like that. Um, and then, uh, I have all these little chalk, chalk pieces, which, um, some have words on them. And what I was thinking about doing is maybe possibly like turning them around if I can. So let me see. So here's the little piece. And so here's the words and this side I could use. So, um, I can definitely use these and I think it's pretty cool to have a little bit of a different kind of texture. So these were $3. Um, I don't think that these were off anymore. So some people were getting them off cheaper, but, um, yeah, they weren't. And then this one right here was $1.57, which I thought was pretty amazing. So it has these, um, canvas sheets, which I think is pretty cool. Um, little hearts. And then it has all the wood, except the hello is actually broken, but that's okay. I'm fine with that. I can fix that. Um, so we got some wood veneers and then we also have some project life cards, which are super cute. They have like little, um, indents, but this is what it looks like all together. I really like this set um, and thought it was cute. So I picked up both of those. And the next thing I picked up were some paper pads that were, one of them was not on sale, but I really, 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 really wanted this one when I saw that they had this heritage from Maggie Holmes, I had to get it. So um, this is an older collection of hers. I love anything Maggie Holmes. I love anything with the designer name, like the, um, I guess it's designer names. I don't know. Sorry guys. So I am taking off the sticker sh little side piece, but I'm just going to flip through. So it is a project pad. So it does have a lot more of the regular paper, which is okay with me. Um, and then it has just like all of the different, um, papers. That's pretty cool. Um, I do love this one right here, this cut apart and it has a gold and then almost like a, like this is more of a goldish silver and this is more of a deep gold. We have some pendants. They're really cute. It would be nice to cut out another gold, uh, gold foil sheet, some letters, and then some of the stickers. So super excited that I was able to get that. It was $6.99, so that's not bad. Um, I know some Tuesday mornings are getting their prices up and they are 
there were a couple things that I wanted to get, but I could not see spending that much money on a paper pad. Um, the next paper pad that I got was on clearance. It was two seventeen. So this is from Echo Park Bundle of Joy. And so I'm just going to flip through super quick. So we got some cut aparts. Um, and so the reason why I picked this up is because I realized that I don't have any, um, like baby boy themed, uh, papers. So I was super excited to see that I had, that they had this and that it was 217. Like you cannot beat that for a paper pad. Um, and it's good, heavy, like cardstock. Um, what else? What was I going to say? Oh, and so I, when I went to, I realized I didn't have boy themed paper because I needed to make a boy, um, like a baby boy, uh, card for a baby shower and they I couldn't find anything in my stash. So I picked that up because I really, really wanted something boy themed. Now let me take a drink. Like I said, guys, this might be a little bit of a long video, um, just because I am going to be flipping through, um, and I should have said this before, that it is going to be a paper haul mainly. Um, it does have a few stickers, so I will go through the stickers first, actually. So, these were for four seventy seven. I have, like, the little tags so some of them all of these were 477 which I don't think is bad I think I got one paper pad that was um besides the one you just saw that was uh five dollars so not that much more so these are all on clearance this is Echo Park's sticker sheet and this is fall so I am going to see about moving this stuff over so then that way I can sit this stuff down and so I have some of these I think I just got rid of one of them I just used one of them up but it's always nice to have more fall themed stuff so this one is from fall in is in the air I think I might have gotten this one or I had it in my cart a while ago but I love these banners I love their banners this one is from their collection Autumn. Super cute. I love this one too. It's almost like a darker uh, vintage look. This one is called Celebrate Autumn. Love this banner. This one is called My Favorite Fall. Really like this one and I think I might have another sticker sheet to go with that. Um, this one is called the story of fall. I love how this has like the fall in the jars, super cute. And what I love about these stickers is that you can pop them up and make them dimensional. So it's almost like you have a dimensional element. Um, this one is called reflections fall. So this doesn't even feel like very folly to me, but um, it's just cool that it's different. Um, I never seen anything like that. This one is super cute. I like this one. It's called Fall Blessings. I love the little apples. They're cute. And the words. I wonder if it tells you. The, this is from 2015. So I was trying to see. 2013. So these are older 2015, sorry, I'm just seeing how what these all are, 2019, 2018, hmm, I don't even know about this one, 2016, and what's this one, sorry guys, 2016, wow, this one is from The Perfect Autumn, this is from 2014, so you can tell back then, they did a lot of um, stickers for the alphas down at the bottom. So that's pretty cool. You see the kind of um, way that they changed their style. So now they use borders. So this is 2017. This is the one that I had. 
Then this one is 2018. I love this blue. Okay, the next paper, or paper, the next sticker pack I got was boy themed. And I believe I only have one of these. So this one is from Once Upon a Time. I think that's really cool. Um, this dragon is pretty cool too. This one is called Little Man, and this is from 2015. I don't know when the other one was. 2017. This one right here is from the All About Boy, and this is 2013. I love that banner. Love those little like um, pool balls. They're cute. This one is A Boy's Life. This is from 2012. Wow. This is cool. I love this. It's very, very neat to have something different like this in your stash. Um, this one right here is from Scout. Scout. This is from 2013. Wow. You can tell back then that the the scrapbooking was more either very vintage or and the colors that were bright had this um brown in it it's just it's crazy and now you you rarely ever see the brown in scrapbooking um this one is from that's my boy it is 2014. oh that is so cool i love that this one is the one that I just almost, I like, I'm almost close to finishing up, but I do love these images. I could use these no matter what. Um, so this is from the Imagine That collection, and that was 2018. This one is from Little Boy, and this is from 2010. Wow. And you can also tell, guys, that the images tend to get a little bit smaller. So... That's crazy. I just love looking at stuff like this and seeing, I love the little choo-choo train, that's cute. And then this one is from Pirate Tales. It is 2019. And I believe I do have some of this collection. This one is from Dino Friends and this is 2016. That's crazy, I do like this one. And I think I might have some of the elements for that. So that is boy. Now we have girl. And so this one is, I, I do have a couple of these, um, but I am okay with having, a, a, you know, a couple of these. So I have a little girl, it'll work. This one is from Jack and Jill and this is 2015. Love that little um, carousel horse and this little pom-pom. Very cute. This takes me back, like, when I first started scrapbooking. These silhouettes were really, really popular, and the typewriter was very, very popular. Um, this one right here is called Peacoats and Pinstripes. I think I might have some of this collection. I'm not sure. This is from 2016. This one's right here from 2017. I have this one, Once Upon a Time. I do love this, this collection. It's just so cute and fun. And I recently got this one and I was super excited to see that they had this in there because I love this. Like this is my favorite sticker sheet. Um, and I knew when I saw the sticker sheet, I was like, man, I wish they sold it separately, but I got another one, this little pinball, oh, everything about this. I love. And that was from 2019. So that one was recent. This one is mermaid dreams and it is from 2019. I think when I went to go get this one way back um, in this like last summer I tried to place an order um, and I think that this one just had come out or something like that and or it was coming out on sale or on discount and it uh, it was gone so 
I didn't get it. This one right here is called Sweet Girl. This is super cute. This is from 2013. That's crazy. Crazy to me. I love looking at all like the different things, just how things have changed from what, you know, back, back then it was just, you know, in these birds, that's another thing. Birds were super popular back then too. So it's just crazy to see how much it's changed. So this one right here, little girl, I actually had this whole collection and used it. Um, back in June, I think I just finished a layout with it, like the rest of it. So it's kind of funny that I got this back again. Um, so this is from 2010. That's crazy. Imagine that. So I think I have this collection as well. This is from 2018. So this is like the boy or the girl theme to the imagine that for the boy. Super cute. I love these colors. And then this one right here I have too. This is Let's Be Mermaids. So 2016. And then the last one is, this is super cute. I love this. Um, it's called The Perfect Princess. Um, and this is from 2017. So I think these little, like the little girls are super cute. All right, guys. So that is all the sticker sheets that I got. Um, they didn't have the winter one or the summer one. I would have gotten both of them. Um, because that is a steal for, for that. Okay, now on to the paper pads. This is my paper stack. I know, I am, need to, I need to stop. But really guys, you can't beat this for these papers. Um, they were four, except for this one. This one was five dollars. Um, and it's kind of crazy to me because this one right here is not a mega kit. These are mega bundles and these were $4.77. So I think it's crazy how their pricing was for this, but oh well. I got a good deal, so I'm not complaining. So this one is from Jungle Safari. It's from 2020. Wow. And you can tell um, this paper is very, it's not it's not really thick. And so the ones that I get to back here are actually pretty thick. So I think, you know, the smaller ones, the paper pads just don't, or the paper just feels kind of a little bit lighter. Um, but also I think Janet did say something that if it has a TM on the bottom of the item number, which these all do, that's made for Tuesday morning. So it's a little bit of a different quality. So I'm just going to flip through these and show you guys what you get. So we will not take too much time, but I do like this because it does give me a little bit of a uh, variety in my scrapbooking and just like, you know, doing different things. So and we did go to the zoo, so I do have some photos of that. Love this one with all the different icons. And this is the back. And then here is the sticker sheet. Super cute. So that was Jungle Safari. This one right here is called Wedding Bliss. And so this is the mega bundle, which is crazy to me because it comes with 12, 12, 12 by 12, six, 12 by 12 solid papers and ephemera die cut sheets and ephemera sticker or uh, element stickers. So I think this is a steal, uh, for $4. And then this is the back of that one. And you, I do not have that many wedding collections, which is crazy to me. So love this heart. Um, and I didn't see when this was 2017. Cute. 
cute flowers and words. The gold words and then this banner. Uh, this is cute. I like that. And then the back is little rings. And then here is the, um, the solids that you get. So I'm not going to... And what's nice is that they're front and back. So there is the front. And I'll flip it over. And you guys can see the back. Ooh, there's the back. And then you get some elements, which I think is pretty fun to play with. Um, I love that they're doing this. And then you also get the sticker sheet. So that was Wedding Bliss, which I am super excited to have. The next one is Sweet Baby Girl. And this is also a mega pack as well. So there's the back of that one. Love these little elements some daisies and like I said I didn't have any baby theme stuff and I don't know if it's because I just um you know haven't really had like anybody in the family have any baby showers um or haven't been in you know into any baby shower like going to any baby showers so this will be nice to have just in case. And also because I can scrap Stella's photos as well. Um, and use it for other things. So there is the colors that you get on that side. And then there is the other side, the B side. Okay, and then you get the elements. So those are the cut aparts. And then you get the stickers. And of course, I had to get the sweet boy too. So got that one. So there's that side. And then there's that side. There is the A side, there's the B side. Cute. Oh, I love this with the little turtles and the black, like, or the black, the brown. And you don't really necessarily have to use this for, um, you know, this collection. You could definitely use that for other collections as well. Love these stars, love them. And then the little onesies, and then you get the month by month or a green stripe. And then you get all of the different solid colors, which is awesome. Like to me, this is totally worth $4. So there's the back side, totally worth $4. I mean, we used to pay $4 for a thing of ephemera, or we still do, but I'm just saying like, these bundles, the way that they're doing it is, uh, it's pretty awesome. So there is the cut aparts. There's more of the cut aparts. Here is the sticker sheets. Okay. And then the next one I got is Faith, Forward with Faith. Um, I don't really have anything that is faith related, so I'm pretty excited for this. So this is the back. And there's that side. So there's two of those. And then the back is this really pretty pink. And it looks like these are like supposed to be um, maybe like the opening of a book or check mark. I don't know. There's some cards and that gingham. So even if you use it just for the gingham, that would be super cute. I'm not a fan of this side, but I do like this side. 
I love this one. Like I can see myself fussy cutting these out. And then the back is some um, of this really pretty blue on blue um, cross paper. And then there's this one right here and some black polka dots. And there's the back of that one. And then you get, let's see, let's see the colors that you get. This really pretty blue. That's cute. Okay, so that's that side. And then that's that side. Super cute. Okay, so that was Forward with Faith. And like I said, guys, these were all, oh, here's the cut aparts for that cute today i choose joy pray more worry less family oh i love this one super cute i love the grace and then this one right here is a sticker sheet which is all gorgeous like love that one okay so like i was saying you can't beat that for how much these things are like I couldn't pass these up okay so this is the last one and this is probably my most favorite out of all of them this is the home again but this is the blue paper oh my gosh it is so pretty so pretty home is my favorite place to be there's the back I am just like uber excited to have this, like this, oh my gosh, this is so pretty. And you know what would go good with some of these is some of the fall collections because it has that wood and blue and then I can just add a pop of, um, a pop of orange to it. I would totally use this side. I don't really care for these as much. I realize that a lot of the home collections that they come out with have pages like this and it's not really my style. I made some cards out of it but that's about it. I love this. It's a lettering board. So cute. And then the leaves are super cute. Look at that. Look at that. Oh my goodness. It's so pretty. Like when I saw this one, I was hoping that it was on Clarence. And the thing is, is that some of them didn't have the red Clarence thing on them. It just had the uh, purple sticker. So if you are looking at Tuesday morning and you see a purple sticker and then you see like a section of like Clarence with red stickers, make sure to take it up there and have them ring it up because mine was coming up, you know, like that was the clearance price. So here are all the solids. Oh, I just love them. They're so pretty. I just love paper and I love embellishments and I love putting kits together. So, so gorgeous. Like I just love everything about this hobby. I love the shopping now. <laughs> um, almost have to like you know stop and not shop anymore but hey it's part of the hobby I think so as long as we watch our spending sometimes and this is just oh my goodness I'm sorry guys I just I'm like just sitting here watching and looking or talking and looking at this and oh blabbing away but I love this one don't know what I'm gonna scrapbook with it yet but I have it in my stash. So that is all that matters to me. So guys, that is it. That is everything that I got. Um, I was super excited to find these, like super excited to find these. And for $4, like you can't, you cannot beat it. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Let me know down below if you have any questions. Let me know what your favorite, um, your favorite collection was. Let me know if you picked up any of these collections. I would love to know. Um, and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye.